first stop, Starbucks. It is nine in the morning, this is the line. So we got our Starbucks. I don't drink coffee, so I just got an ice water. Cause they have delicious ice water cause it's, it's always ice and very cold. And normally they give you the big one if you ask, but this is good for me and mom got my uh, latte. Headed into studios cause we're gonna go get some breakfast at Today Cafe. It is 9 a.m. Park technically just opened. It was 8 a.m. for early morning. And this is the crowd going in. And we are very shocked that there are no horror signs out yet. Normally when we're here, they're already out. And it starts soon, so I wonder when they're coming up. All right, so we stopped at the Today Cafe. Mama got... Uh, chocolate chip muffin. Double chocolate chip, just chocolate chip. It looks pretty dark. Yeah, it does. And I just got a croissant. And we're sitting outside. They have a lot of seats outside. They have all the doors open inside as well. It's always empty going this way. Everyone's heading over here. But still, all the waits are basically walk-ons for the park being open. An hour and a half with early morning, half hour for everyone. Escape the Green Gods is the longest wait at 20 minutes. All right, we got the mystery machine coming out. Look who it is! Alright, the whole gang is out. They are in front of Mel's with the cars. Which usually the cars are never here when I am because they take them away for horror nights. But they're out. Still social distance. You can get a picture in front of them. And Fred is wearing his mask. The others are not. sitting here patiently waiting for Beetlejuice. We don't know if he'll come out, but we're hoping. <laughs> Fingers crossed. All right. <laughs> they found us. Ooh, look at that shirt. Look at that shirt. What? Yesterday, after you came, I was, I wrote it green dot. No way. Did you love it? No. No. I mean, I like it a little bit. Was it scary? Come talk to me. You have to look at me when you talk. I didn't. Yeah, I was scared. Yeah. All right, tell me, wait, where, where are we going? To the world and world. So which way is that? This way, because the Simpsons rise on me. That means the Simpsons park is that way. That's true. So twirl oh, and hurl yeah. this way. Oh, Bradley knows where he's going. For horror nights. <laughs> for horror nights, we're back for horror nights. Back to horror nights. What do you think of it? Does it look cool? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, what do you think it looks like? A bit like from the alien from Man Black Alien. Oh, an alien. Yeah, it looks like all the alien from Man Black Alien. That is true. It does look like a Men in Black alien. Yeah, it's not just like his claws. That is true. I like that's your... That's face. I like that. Oh, but that's those. Oh. But I found the two of them. There are two of them. So which way are we going now? Oh, he knows where he's going, even after not being here for two years. Oh, Doc! Hello. <laughs> oh, we got some theme park ducks where the water is. Getting a nice bath. Oh, they want to break from the actor, animal actors. Oh, they're on break? break um because they, they got a 15 minute break uh, that is true say, Came what, the get a little cool what are the animals saying go ahead you you know how to read perfect perfect all right chris and eugene and bradley are going on twirl and hurl as bradley says the simpsons dumbo <laughs> Did you hurl? I almost did. Did you hurl? Yeah. 
Oh, Mama, did you hurl? I'm a little dizzy. Yeah, that one gets me sometimes. Here, Brad. <laughs> Hi, creature. Stop knocking on my door. So before this trip, Riley finally watched all of the Harry Potters. What'd you think? The last movie, they destroyed it. They just they destroyed. What was his name? Voldemort. Again? Yeah, they destroyed Voldemort. Yeah. Tell everyone what house you are. Gryffindor. What's T T? Hey, don't say it like that. <laughs> All right, show me. Crowd update. It is 11 o'clock, and this is what it's looking like. This is definitely the most crowded section of the park, and it's still not. Ooh. All right, Bradley has his jaw shirt on, so he's taking his picture. There he is. He is a 10-minute wait. Kristen and Eugene are heading on to the mummy. We're taking Bradley. We're gonna go over to Jimmy Fallon to see if we can get the tour. Not sure. We did ask at Men in Black and they said it usually starts after 11, uh, usually around 11.30. So it is around that time. So maybe Jimmy Fallon will let us. The Halloween Horror Nights Tribute Store. Not open yet. Coming soon. Crowd update it is 11.30. Still everything seems to be a walk-on. So we're in the Jimmy Fallon tour. We're doing it. Woohoo! This is his hashtag, the panda dance. That is literally what he does. That was good. Standard definition cameras used for Jay Leno. Um, and I think Johnny Carson, Jay Leno. This is one of the last standard definition cameras used. That's why a bit of his right where for some reason he got hit for 30 years he didn't have uh, that hat there from his uh, it's from his estate. So this, this was actually used in the uh, show. This wasn't, that's not like Brett, but that's not first of all. Uh, his contract was, uh, he was contracted until 2009 to do it.
one like right there. That's so much fun. Did you like it? A little. A little. He just came off and he just, what did you just say? What? No, no, what'd you say? I forget. How cool was that? <laughs> he did not want to go on this. He kept saying no, 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 no. And then I was like, all right, we'll just do the tour. And that's it. And then he went right on and he loved it. I didn't love it. He's a very stubborn child. Stubborn, runs in the family. <laughs> But thank you, Heath, for a great tour. It was awesome. Was it a good tour? You learned a lot. We learned a lot. We got to put our pin in New Jersey. Loved it. Thank you again. Stopped into Panda Express for some lunch. It is the most Panda Express, and over here is the, the orange chicken and lo mein, and you do get your annual pass discount here. Oh my god, the kids orange chicken and lo mein, and it comes with a drink and a cookie, and I should have gotten that. But I got the bowl instead, and the girl bamboozled me and gave me double orange, so I ended up paying a lot more than I wanted to, so I'm very mad. We are heading out of the park, and it is 1 o'clock, and this is what it looks like coming and going. Very low crowds. Just got back from the gym, and it was not crowded. I went at about... 2 o'clock, I'd say? Yeah, 2 o'clock. And I was by myself for a little bit and then some people came just to walk on the treadmill so I was able to do weights today. So it was much, much calmer. So that is always the time I recommend going because most people are in the parks. So I think mornings and nights are super busy. So anytime like during midday is pretty good time to go. They also do clean at certain hours so I have to make sure to look at what those hours are tomorrow um, I can't tell if they close for cleaning disinfecting kind of thing uh, or it's just like when they'll be in there so I'll look at that sign a little bit better tomorrow but yeah so came back to the to the hotel because we were supposed to go pick up our Walmart groceries but it got cancelled on us so now we have to pick them up tomorrow so we are seeing what the night will bring. This is Pier 8 Food Court at 6.15. No one here. I got the two piece chicken and waffle with mashed potatoes and I got it to try with the buffalo sauce. Mama got a caprese sandwich. Caprese sandwich. A lot of bread. Muffalada. I got a chicken, chicken salad, salad sandwich on a croissant and broccoli soup that I could soup. swim in. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. How was your sandwich, Mama? It was very good. I enjoyed it. Yeah, nice size too. She only ate half of it. Yeah. Is that a question for me? Yeah. So, I had the chicken on a croissant, chicken salad, it was very good. It didn't have the grapes though. They're supposed to slice grapes this Did you in. ins inspect it? I did. There were no grapes. Oh. So that was missing. But it was good. Um, I had the broccoli soup. Don't get it. Tasteless. Very big. It's a lot. But no, no flavor. So, wasted calories. For a grab and go item, did you think it was fresh? Uh, for the most oh, part. Yeah. I did. Yes. I liked it. It was yeah. very good. And I got the two-piece chicken with a side of mashed potatoes, no gravy. Chicken was really good. Uh, very fresh, uh, juicy, good chicken. Mashed potatoes, I love that kind of mashed potatoes. Delicious, and then it came up with a waffle. I don't eat it as like chicken and waffles. I eat the chicken separate, and then I just put butter on the waffle, and it was a good waffle. For nine bucks, I think that's a, a good meal. Uh, he did ask if you like dark or white meat, so like, you could get like a big piece of chicken. I asked because I like a uh, leg and a wing, so like mine was on the smaller side. But if you wanted the bigger piece, like you could have asked for it. A plus so far. And just like that, another day has come to an end. Uh, today we didn't get to do what we wanted to do. Walmart canceled our order, so we left the park midday to pick that up and it did not work out. So now we have it scheduled. Hopefully we get it this time. And we just ate in the food court. Uh, Dad is working so got off later than he was hoping to so we ate in the food court but it was really good. 
Uh, I didn't really eat at Surfside when we stayed there, so can't really give you that, but I know they did not like Surfside food, so, so far, liking the food. So, with that, I say, good night, everyone!